Welcome to my final, um, Pikmin, uh, day. I thought, uh, we'd just end things off with a simple exploration of the distant spring. Just thought that would be a good way to end things off. So that'd be pretty cool. Let's, uh, get right into it. The distant spring. Here we are. So tonight we're not really going to be focusing on uh, parts. I just thought we'd end off our Pikmin um, adventures with just a simple, just a simple exploration of the place. Check the place out, uh, and we'll take the blues with us. It will bring fifty. Let's just walk around and see what we can do. So this place is quite massive. Let's just walk around and see what happens. Ooh. That looks pretty yellow Pikmin-y there. Whatever that thing is. A lot of water here. It's pretty decent looking water. It's very nice music, too. Hmm. How do you go around here? What is that thing? That turns Pikmin into blue ones. Oh, there's a part. A massage machine. Put this right down in the lower back area and let it go to work. I can't wait until I get it installed again, as my lower lumbar region has been painting me ever since the crash. Ah, sweet relief. Where are we in comparison? We're like a billion miles away. Alright. I guess we can try that out then. Um, those things be looking kind of dead. There's a bridge though. There's those things though. Um, alright, let's do this. actually call a couple of them. Let's not call all of them. Let's, you guys just stay here. Um, let's get some of you to carry this along over here. And we'll uh, get this, I guess. Oh, did I need another one? Alright. I needed ten more. Now, I'm gonna assume that these guys are very intelligent Pikmin. They're not gonna walk through the little the little black gold board guy. They're totally they're just gonna leave it all nice and alone here, they're not gonna bother it in any way. Just gonna walk around it, like nice, uh... Uh, yeah. It's, it's pretty nice. What is over this bridge? I wonder. There's that. It's like the frog things from the navel, but they're not. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Let's get these guys so they don't have to just stand there waiting. Uh, let's get these guys to fight big old froggy over there. And then we still have enough Pikmin over there with the bridge that in case a couple of guys die here, we can, uh, we can still um, have enough. There we go. And then we're just right there at home. Isn't that cool? That's pretty darn cool if you ask me. 
Um, okay, I guess while we can wait, we can, uh, take that across. Uh, where do they think they're going? Why are they going that way? Like, the thing's right there. There we are. We get, yeah, someone to carry that. I've been wanting so much. I don't know how to talk. Alrighty. Next day. Alright, what's due today? Um, so there's that, which seems to require yellows that we don't have. Here's a fun idea I have. Let's go just, let's go kill some things, but then when we bring them back here, we'll have the yellows put them in their base. Doesn't that sound like a fun idea? Hey, wasn't that fun? You're next. Ugh. Alright, cool. Alright, watch this. I think we only have six... I don't think we even have six yellows anymore. We're just going to have to bring the pellet in first uh, to give them the five. Oh, we don't even have... We don't even have five. So how can we bring that thing? Here, okay. I think if a majority of them are yellow, and then we can just bring in, like, one blue... And then it'll still bring it to yellow. Because the majority are, um... The majority are yellow. And now we have five yellows. Where do you guys think you're going? Okay, yeah, you ain't gonna do nothing. Look at me. Yeah. I don't care. Let's not do that right now. How do I, how do I get that thing? If we could stop moving for like one second. something.
Why are you going in the water? I wish this thing was dead. Then it's gonna recharge fully for tomorrow. Then I'd have to just spend a whole day trying to get it again. Oh well. At least we have a few more yellows. Just don't think we have enough. Alright, um, so this will be the last day, and I want to try to at least accomplish something. Uh, I want to try to get that cool piece that's up there in that tiny space. Maybe. I don't know, I want to figure something out. One of them looks like I could use some blues to get. I guess maybe I'll do that. more bridges. Let's see here. Let's get some of you guys working on this. Let's try to get to this side now. Got a couple of those things. Uh, let's not. Oh, that's stupid things here, too. There's so many stupid things here. I just die. So we lost like a billion things as a result of that. Let's get this one now. Oh wait, there's another guy. Hold up for a second. All oh, right, already dead. All right, you guys get working on this side of the bridge now. Uh, these guys are still working. Interesting. The rest of you guys can get working on this part. Another oh, snatchy thing's back. Um, but it's going that way. Let's see what this thing is. What did I just do? Okay. The the thing. It's very scientific. It was very expensive. Hmm. This little guy is just kind of punching stuff on his own here. Like everyone else here is working collectively, but then this guy is just like doing his own thing. Oh, now he, now he's working together with the rest of them. That's what I call teamwork. Well, these aren't all of our blues, so I guess I can get the rest of them out while we're waiting. This is not super far away. And there aren't really anything... There's nothing crazy besides maybe the snatchy guy. Um, around here. 
so that's good. Alright, all of you peeps. Let's uh, finish this bridge here. interesting. Wow. So this side was a little longer than the other side of it. Alright, let's carry this along, guys. I'm gonna guess 30 is the amount. Oh, 50? This thing requires a lot. Do we even have 50? We don't even have 50. We can change that, though. Let's get these things. I mean, technically, do we even need blues? Because, like, it's the whole bridge, and then they could just probably just walk across the whole thing. Um, so that might be good. I don't know why they're using that instead of the bridge, but you know what? Who cares? Oh, boy. The thing's awake... That thing's not looking very nice. It ain't gonna come in the water, it's too dumb. Why, why, do you, why are you doing that? Yes, we like have none right now. Um, so I don't know what you're doing and why you're not going across the bridge. Yeah, that's right. Stay away from the thing. Don't fight it. And, uh, someone carry that. Very careful there. Please don't touch the thing. Alright. Good. Hopefully nothing happened here. Why did someone make a hmm? Oh, that thing. What are these anyway? Oh. Why don't you look at that? Alright. The final priority of our game is to go get that last piece, that 50 Pikmin piece. And then hopefully we'll have enough time to bring it across, but we'll have to see. There we are. And we are going to stay behind just in case we need to take any extra precautions. I have no idea how extra dangerous this thing is compared to um, regular ones. But I don't feel like finding out right now. So hopefully these guys will uh, do something. You could try to find, fight it, see what happens. Seems pretty standard, it's just that it looks weird and really evil. Yeah, just look at me, don't mind the uh the the big guys carrying the uh the big piece there. Yeah, look at us. Uh, here, let's let's have it chase us this way. <laughs> it tripped. Hi there, look at me, look at me. Come this way, there's ten seconds. Alright, so I think they're far away, uh, far enough that they're not, uh, the thing is not gonna notice them. Alright, we should have enough time now, uh, for that part to go through. 
Yeah, look at that. It's a technological thing. I've now recovered 17 parts, and that's uh, where we'll be leaving off in this uh, game. <laughs> that's probably not the best way to, to do that. As long as everyone's here, you should be alright. I have pretty no freaking idea. I left one behind, wow. Alright. So we'll spend the last few minutes here um, reflecting, as you do. I really like the characters and the environments in this game. I like Olimar, he's a very nice character. I like that he's got a little bit of a story for himself. He's got a wife and a couple of kids. Um, and he works at some place. Uh, and it seems pretty cool. Uh, the Pikmin are very adorable. Um, rather silly. All the different colors have like unique traits. The red ones have something. Uh, they have a nose. The yellow ones have ears and the blue ones have a mouth. Now let's talk about the um, some flaws. You know, there's some things I didn't like that much about this uh, this game. So I, the, I think the number one thing is the time constraint. It's just like you have 30 days and there are 30 pieces. Get them all. It feels very limiting to me uh, and to my experience. I feel like I can't fulfill exactly what I do in this game. Um, when I have like that kind of time limit in the back of my mind. I feel like I can't spend time exploring like I just did there. Along with the time restriction, there's also... Sometimes the Pikmin are really dumb. <laughs> um, but that's that's like that's not like a flaw with the game, I think. It's just how they are. Um, I will say it's a little tricky throwing them and trying to aim precisely. I don't know if that's ever fixed in the newer games. Uh, but it's just like kind of weird and a little wonky sometimes. It's like you try to throw them and uh, you can't throw while you're moving at the same time, which is unfortunate. You have to be standing still to throw them. Um, and when it comes to moving creatures like the uh, swooping snitch thing, uh, it's just impossible. And then I don't know. Sometimes you throw them and they just just stand there and have no idea what they're supposed to do. Uh, but again, that's just a, just a minor nitpick. And then uh, one more positive thing I intentionally left off here, and that's the incredible music of this game. Uh, this, the music in this game is great. Really great stuff. It, it's like, it would be very suitable for just nice study music that you have on in the background. Um, and it's great. So there you go. That's, um, that's this for you. This is, um, this is Ben Pikmin. Overall, decent game. It is not for me because I, I do not do well with time restrictions. I love the gameplay. Just the idea that, like, the Pikmin are doing most of the work for you. And it's just, like, a really unique and weird thing. Versus, um, you know, you doing all your nice work in, um, in other games that are... I don't, know, I don't know if there's any game similar to this, but, uh... It's like, it's really interesting. I guess the last thing we can talk about is coming back to the original question. The whole reason I played this, minus needing something to do before I leave. Will this game make me want to pick up Pikmin 3? Um, if Pikmin 3 was exactly like this game, then I would not. I would not pick the game up. But I already know uh, from people have told me about the game and from people who I've watched play the game particularly uh, I watched my brother play the game when it came out and I didn't know what he was doing I was just watching um, but I don't ever remember there being like a, a massive time restriction like this I, I think I heard Pikmin 3's like the main priority is getting food supply or something um, so that's cool I might pick up Pikmin 3 Deluxe um, that being said and I think that'll be fun um, and I'll, I'll let you guys know if I uh, d decide to stream it or not. We've pretty much fulfilled everything that I wanted to get out of this series. Just kind of, just getting my hands on a Pikmin game, because I've never played one before. I feel like I did fairly okay. Uh, 
maybe not, um, for my first time playing, um, a game. This game's fun, uh, and it's great, just a good little silly, fun, simple, cute game. Um, alright, thanks for watching, guys. I don't know what else I'm gonna do with the YouTube channel now that this is over, but, um, I'll think of something. So, uh, you know, hope you guys have an, a nice day, a nice weekend, uh, matter of fact. And I hope to see you guys some other time. Goodbye.